how to install WordPress on HostGator hosting. Craig here and I'm creating a quick video to show you just how easy it is to install WordPress on HostGator hosting via the cPanel. Now the cPanel is also known as the control panel and I'm going to just assume that you've already signed up for HostGator and you've added a domain to your hosting account. So once you log into your control panel, it's going to look like this. And what we need to find is under software services, we need to click on quick install. In the past, I used to use Fantastico Deluxe, but uh, they introduced quick install. And I believe that is the best option as they may be phasing out Fantastico Deluxe. So click on quick install. And here we have a list of different software programs that we can install on our hosting. Now we want to install WordPress, so I'll click on it once. It's just giving us a little bit of information here, telling us it's going to install WordPress version 3.4.2. And so we're going to click continue. Now on this screen, we have to select the domain name that we want to install our WordPress installation on. I'm going to blur this out, but I have a number of domains. And what I've done is I've created a a test subdomain to install WordPress on. So it's test1.wainvite.com. Now, if I wanted to install it in a different directory, for example, my blog is thewiseaffiliate.com and WordPress is installed in the root directory. But if, for example, I wanted to install it on thewiseaffiliate.com slash blog, then I would enter in blog here and obviously select the WISE affiliate domain from the dropdown. Personally, I don't like installing it in different directories and I always like to have it installed on the root directory of the domain. So enable auto upgrades, yeah, we're gonna leave that checked. Admin email address. Now blog title, you can enter in whatever you like. You can change this from inside the blog admin area. And the username, Default, most people go with admin, but it's not recommended you go with admin because just for security reasons, I recommend you go with something like a nickname that you generally use. And then you're gonna enter in your first and last name. And that's it, we're gonna click on install now. You'll see a little progress bar here, it goes pretty fast. And there we are, we're ready, we're rocking and rolling. So it's gonna give us our username and password. It's gonna give us the link to access the login page. Now, if for some reason you lose this password, uh, just go check your email. You'll get a new WordPress installation email, which you can keep. So if we want to have a look at our WordPress installation, this is it right here. This is the default WordPress installation hosted on our own hosting. And as you can see, my domain name is test1.wainvite.com. And that is pretty much how you go about installing WordPress on HostGator hosting. Now, if you like this video, don't forget to hit the like button and subscribe to my channel. Uh, I'm often posting new WordPress related videos and I have a whole bunch of videos on my channel which will show you how to build your very own website and much more. If you have any questions, you know, post a comment below and I'll respond within 24 hours. Have a great day.